Probably can't tell right now, but my eye has a little bubble in it. I woke up this morning. My wife and I had to come to Houston because tomorrow she has an appointment with the Spanish Embassy. And um, hey, baby, so what's up? Hi. We just checked into our hotel. We just got to Houston. And um, I started rubbing my eye, and it was super red. There's a little bubble there. So anyway, I'm hungry, and we got a pretty good view. The lady downstairs hooked it up. I'm wearing glasses. Shout Casey, out to I don't Fatima. know. Yeah, Fatima hooked it up. Um, we have a really good view, so I'll let you guys see that. And we're going to go taste some good food. I've been excited since I got here. I mean, I've been excited since before we got here about tasting this um, vegan buffet restaurant that I tasted with Andrew and the guys a few weeks ago at the men's retreat. So, anyway, I'm excited. Talk to y'all soon. So this is our view. Not too bad. Another the gallery, yeah. Um, I'm not going to lie. As much as I'm a city boy, I'm starting to hate traffic. So Houston traffic and Dallas traffic and forward traffic just get to my last nerves. But it's okay. So I think the place we're going to eat is maybe like four minutes from here. The reason I like this place is because it's not just vegan food, it's actually plant-based food. So they have like jackfruit, which tastes amazing. They got good vegetables, noodles, rice, so. I have no idea what this is, but it looks super yummy because it's fried. <laughs> <laughs> See, is it good? Mm, it has veggies. Mm, it's really good. Yeah. So mm -hmm. anyway, so we're about to throw down. We just finished eating some yummy food and Leah needed to get some stuff at CVS, and um, I saw myself on TV. I think I'm famous. Hola. Come on, you babies, you're so cute. Why are you spending money? Look at the babies. What are you buying? Tweezers and a mirror. Yeah, she left hers at the house, so. Uh, can we return it once you're done using it? <laughs> Morning, so my wife is a little nervous. Why are you nervous? I have an appointment with the consulate when they get my citizenship to Spain or back. <laughs> I lost it because I didn't know how to, re I guess, renew it or reinstate it at 18 years old. So I didn't even know I was a citizen up until that point until I decided I should get dual citizenship. And so I started the process and I found out that I had a Spanish birth certificate in the consulate in Los Angeles. So I have to come to Houston to get it reinstated. So. So that's what we're gonna do this morning, and um, it's a beautiful day. She's nervous. I don't know why. I think she's got warrants. So <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Uh, I'm nervous. Why are you nervous? I don't know. There's no reason for me to ner be nervous, but I'm so nervous. We just got here, we just parked, and my wife's acting really nervous. I'm getting nervous now. She's nervous. <laughs> I don't even know what you're nervous about. I don't either. But we'll make it. What if they're mean to me? And they're like, we don't want you. <clears throat> what about the, are they going to speak only Spanish? No, I mean, I don't think so. This America! <laughs> anyway. That's the consulate. <laughs> oh, that's true. Okay, um, I have a question. No, I've been communicating with them through email uh, in English. So. so I have a question. So here's the the consulate. Does that mean the moment I walk in there, I'm on Spanish territory or Spain? Or anyway, I don't think. Or is so, that sworn embassy? Because that's the embassy. Okay. I don't think this is the same thing. All right. Well, for those of y'all who are watching, I'm half Mexican, and I'm about to go into Spain. Yeah, here we know this. <laughs> All right, let's go.